Hi, welcome to Arch Merch 6.3.1. We are 1st January 2018 and we are talking about the touchpad. This is a lower resolution since I'm working on my laptop, so you'll notice it in YouTube. What you can do if you want to have a double tap in your touchpad? That's the question that people ask all the time and I'm afraid I have not made any tutorial about it yet. So, ArchWiki, that's the two words you always start with. And then you say touchpad, that's a possibility. And then you see you have here this, the first one and that's probably the one you're gonna use, the first one. And it's a, a name anyway to remember, Synaptics. And it says here, warning, XF86 input Synaptics is no longer actively updated. P please of if possible use lip input so this is our fallback if things don't work on lip input you'll go to sit synaptics this one but in 6.3.1 i did not install this file this application is not installed and i went over to lip input and it was actually the second line lip input arch wiki arch linux so if you want to change things uh, on your system, it's up to you to decide uh, what you should do, where you should do it and all that. So all explanations are in here, but for Arch Merge, it's gonna be a little bit uh, easier. So this is a file where you can change things. So that's the, the uh, file where you can say tapping on like this one, yeah? tapping on aka tap to click, click method, click finger and so on, but we're on Arch Merch and we have XFCE. This is open box, I know that, so right mouse click, this is open box, but open box uses XFCE elements and of course when we log off in here and go to XF, XFCE, it's all XFCE. What do you do if you want to have double tap? The easy way, the GUI way, graphic user interface on your system. Control Alt M is the button or the shortcut to get to the XFCE settings. There's also a way in here. And you have here mouse and touchpad and you see you can do some stuff about your USB gaming mouse. That's the one that's hooked up here. And this is of course your own Syn uh, Synaptics PS2 Synaptics touchpad. In here you have a tab and if you say tab touchpad to click so that's up to you to find this setting set it on what's fixed now well if you click on this thing you can go to tunar and you can go let's leave the mouse what it is and now double click on public so we can actually uh, click and drop as well so public is in here and put it back on Eric like so so that's all possible, double click and click drag um, is now set to go, but um, this is, will work, this easy way will work on XFCE and on OpenBox, but if you're on i3, and that's just probably a few of you guys, but anyway, I'm making a full tutorial on Arch Merge, so i3 is in here as well, you have here this XFCE no startup XFC settings demons. I've I've made a hashtag before, like so. So if you delete the hashtag, then it's gonna read the XFCE settings and it's gonna know ah, I should double click and I should be able to drag, drag and drop. So that's the line you need to hashtag out and you'll figure it, uh, you'll see if you log off and log on again, that everything will work in i3 as well. So that's uh, the way, the easy way, the, the, the graphical way. And the other way is actually go inside a file or make a file even and make sure that tapping is set to on. So you can have more information in here, like so. Lots of settings you can change, but why make it difficult if it can be easy? Um, so. I suppose this concludes the tutorial. If you want to go the other way, you should go also to user lip. What was it again? Let me check here. So if you want to have the other way, was it share? 
x11 config and here you can find some information so this file libinput.conf you can get this one and say at some point in time where should we put it catch all touch screen tablet touch pads i'm wondering if it's this one or that one or even that one so anyway um we don't have to bother with all these uh, things in here but if you are on arch merged then probably you'll have to make this file work so you can put this you can change this one here or you can make and that's probably better copy paste this thing over to where it should be and that's etc x11 xorg put it in here because there is already one for the keyboard but there is none for the touchpad so if you put it in here with your settings your uh, settings that you can read from the net this one any of these elements you can change natural scrolling through and so on and so on you can see graphical tools cinnamon we can do it in cinnamon so arched merged cinnamon is ready as of now uh, anytime soon gnome will follow and you can set it in gnome and cinnamon i see so i copy paste from this one to this one well 30 or 40 doesn't really matter the number but this is what it needs to contain the file and then you're uh, up to go uh, ready to go and if you want to make files well the easiest way i think is sublime text you have also the possibility always ah come on eric right mouse click open folder as root if you want to so that's uh, a way to just make a file say okay wait for it it's gonna open so the yellow border right mouse click create documents and you, then you start typing and copy pasting and changing and then of course remember to log off and log on again and try out what setting works for your specific hardware i'll put this tutorial on uh, the websites and also on the forum all right enjoy